Hi there, today I will say some tips and tricks for the Lenovo A7000. So without any further ado, let's get started. So the first feature is double tap to wake up. Now go to settings and go to feature. You find that tap to light option and just enable that. After enabling just go back and now just test it out. As you can see the lock screen appears. It almost works fine out of 10 times it works for around 8 to 9 times which is pretty good. Now the second feature is quick snap. Now again go to settings and go to feature and enable that quick snap option. Once you enable just go back and lock the device now and press volume down or up button twice and it takes a shot. This is a pretty good feature in my opinion because you don't have to open the phone, unlock the screen, uh, open the camera up and take the shot. This is a pretty long process. So this is a good feature. And the third thing is ultimate power saver mode. Now again go to settings and find the power manager option and just enable ultimate power saver mode. So this brings you to a completely different mode. In this you can do some basic features like calling, messaging and clock. But the battery life you get on this is amazing. You almost get 4 days if you have that full charge. You can also close or disable this mode by just clicking that X button on the top. This will bring you to the normal mode. And the fourth feature is Team Center. As you can see, you find Team Center here. Now just open it and you find many themes here. You enable whatever you like, but I will enable this age theme. It takes 2 to 3 seconds. And as you can see, the icons got changed. And like these you can also change wallpapers and you also have that option to change lock screen uh, you get many but i prefer android l lock screen now as you can see i have the android l lock screen you also have that option to change multitasking view it's the default Lenovo one and this is the android l one i'll apply this one and as you can see it works like charm now let's just go back and the fourth feature is white touch again just go to settings and go to feature and enable that white touch once you enable you get that rectangular box and you when you click that you get some options where you can switch between any of the apps like simple tools camera calculator and all those you can also switch to that wi-fi enabling mode bluetooth enabling mode and all those by just clicking it as you can see we can open the camera app and you can also go to settings and you can switch between these things enable wi-fi and this is a pretty good feature so the sixth thing is smart gestures this is a decent one you all know about it but it's a good thing to get in this device just go enable this nv or o and yeah now let's just go back and test it v camera and yeah you got it now oh, chrome yeah and we got it so it also works fine so that's pretty much it for this video guys thanks for watching if you have any doubts regarding this device feel free to comment them and after all if you want to know who is this this is nish and i hope to see you all in my next video so all guys have a great day